the maned wolf is the largest canid of South America. Its markings resemble those of foxes, but it is not a fox, nor is it a wolf, as it is not closely related to other canids. It is the only species in the genus Chrysocyon. This mammal is found in open and semi-open habitats, especially grasslands with scattered bushes and trees, in South, Central West, and Southeastern Brazil, Paraguay, Northern Argentina, Bolivia east and north of the Andes, and far southeastern Peru. It is very rare in Uruguay, possibly being displaced completely through loss of habitat. IUCN lists it as near threatened, while it is considered vulnerable by the Brazilian government. It is known locally as Agaraguaza, or Calac by the Toba, Lobo de Crin, Lobo de los Esteros, or Lobo Colorado, and as Lobo Gara in Brazil. It also is called Borichai in Bolivia. Description The maned wolf bears minor similarities to the red fox, although it belongs to a different genus. The average adult weighs 23 kilograms and stands 90 centimeters tall at the shoulder, has a head body length of 100 centimeters with the tail adding another 45 centimeters. The maned wolf is the tallest of the wild canids. Its long legs are likely an adaptation to the tall grasslands of its native habitat. Fur of the maned wolf may be reddish brown to golden orange on the sides with long, black legs, and a distinctive black mane. The coat is marked further with a whitish tuft at the tip of the tail and a white bib beneath the throat. The mane is erectile, and typically, is used to enlarge the wolf's profile when threatened or when displaying aggression. The maned wolf also is known for the distinctive odor of its territory markings, which has earned it the nickname Skunk Wolf. Habits equals Hunting and territoriality equals, and like other large canids the maned wolf does not form packs. It hunts alone, usually between sundown and midnight. It kills its prey by biting on the neck or back, and shaking the prey violently if necessary. Monogamous pairs may defend a shared territory of approximately 30 km too, although outside of mating, the individuals may meet seldom. The territory is crisscrossed by paths that the maned wolves create as they patrol at night. Several adults may congregate in the presence of a plentiful food source, for example, a fire-cleared patch of grassland that would leave small vertebrate prey exposed while foraging. Both female and male maned wolves use their urine to communicate, for example to mark their hunting paths or the places where they have buried hunted prey. The urine has a very distinctive odor, which some people liken to hops or cannabis. The responsible substance very likely is a pyrazine, which also occurs in both plants. The preferred habitat of the maned wolf include grasslands, scrub prairies, and forests. Equals reproduction equals. Their mating season ranges from November to April. Gestation lasts 60 to 65 days and a litter may have from 2 to 6 black furred pups, each weighing approximately 450 g. Pups are fully grown when one year old. During that first year, the pups are known to rely on their parents for food. Equals diet equals, the maned wolf is omnivorous. It specializes in small and medium-sized prey, including small mammals, birds, and even fish but a large portion of its diet is vegetable matter, including sugarcane, tubers, and fruit. Traditionally, captive maned wolves were fed meat-heavy diets, but that caused them to develop bladder stones. Zoo diets for them now feature fruits and vegetables, as well as meat and dog chow. Equals relations with other species equals, the maned wolf participates in symbiotic relationships. It contributes to the propagation and dissemination of the plants that it feeds on, through excretion. Often maned wolves defecate on the nests of leaf-cutter ants. The ants then use the dung to fertilize their fungus gardens, but they discard the seeds contained in the dung onto refuse piles just outside their nests. This process significantly increases the germination rate of the seeds. The maned wolf is not a common prey species for any predator, although it may be attacked or killed by feral dogs. An additional threat to the maned wolf exists from sharing territory with domestic dogs. The maned wolf is particularly susceptible to infection by the giant kidney worm, a potentially fatal parasite that also may infect domestic dogs. Equals relations with humans equals, generally, 
the maned wolf is shy and flees when alarmed, so it poses little direct threat to humans. Popularly, the maned wolf is thought to have the potential of being a chicken thief. It once was considered a similar threat to cattle and sheep, although this now is known to be false. Historically, in a few parts of Brazil, these animals were hunted down for some body parts, notably the eyes, that were believed to be good luck charms. Since its classification as a vulnerable species by the Brazilian government, it has received greater consideration and protection. They are threatened by habitat loss and being run over by automobiles. Feral and domestic dogs pass on diseases to them, and have been known to attack them. The species occurs in several protected areas, including the national parks of Cara Section A and Dimas in Brazil. The maned wolf is well represented in captivity and has been bred successfully at a number of zoos, particularly in Argentina. Taxonomy Although the maned wolf displays many fox like characteristics, it is not closely related to foxes. It lacks the elliptical pupils found distinctively in foxes. The maned wolf's evolutionary relationship to the other members of the canid family makes it a unique animal. Electrophoretic studies did not link Chrysocyon with any of the other living canids studied. One conclusion of this study is that the maned wolf is the only species among the large South American canids that survived the late Pleistocene extinction. Fossils of the maned wolf from the Holocene and the late Pleistocene have been excavated from the Brazilian highlands. A study published in 2003 on the brain anatomy of several canids, placed the maned wolf together with a Falkland Islands wolf and with pseudo-foxes of the genus Pseudolopex. One study based on DNA evidence, published in 2009, showed that the extinct genus Dusician, the Falkland Islands wolf and its mainland relative, was the most closely related species to the maned wolf in historical times, and that about 7 million years ago it shared a common ancestor with that genus. A 2015 study reported genetic signatures in maned wolves that are indicative of population expansion followed by contraction and that took place during Pleistocene interglaciations approximately 24,000 years before present. The maned wolf is not closely related to any other living canid. It is not a fox, wolf, coyote, dog, or jackal, but a distinct canid. Although based only on morphological similarities, it previously had been placed in Canis and Vulp's genera. Its closest living relative is the bush dog and it has a more distant relationship to other South American canines. Gallery. References. External links. Archiva Euro images and movies of the maned wolf. Consorti Macria, Adriana G. The maned wolf in captivity. Canid News, Volume 2, 1994. Accessed March 12, 2007. Garog, Antonia. Chris Assign Brachyurus. Animal Diversity Web. Accessed March 12, 2007. Emmons, Louise, 1, The Secret Wolf.